Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, my name is Beth Swan and thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you haven't yet subscribed, please do head down, click that subscribe button, press the little notification bell as well just to make sure that you never miss whenever I post a new video. So I'm doing this intro very quickly, I might refilm it later, but I'm just about to head off and meet Emma because we're going to go to VidCon this weekend. I am absolutely speechless over the fact that I'm going to get the opportunity to perform at VidCon London on Saturday night, the 22nd of February at the Night of Awesome in front of so many incredible fans with some incredible creators. It's so, so exciting. I've been given the opportunity to bring one friend along as well, so who else but Emma. So enjoy the vlog. Um, yeah, I'm running extremely late as usual, so I'm going to run now. <laughs> but um, yeah, enjoy the vlog. Time. So we were supposed to vlog coming here, but we were in a proper rush. Um, but it is the Friday, the 21st, um, and we are. I'm going to do a sound check today, which is exciting. Um, and yeah, so we're going to vlog as we go along. We don't really know what today is going to be like, but it's going to be a sound check and then just heading off, I think. But and we're going to go yeah. see the boy too tonight. So that's yeah, cool. we're going to go see a horror film, which is fun. So yeah, we'll vlog along the way. Um, but. Probably won't film too much today because I think it's just going to be a sound check. Hello! So we are just out, but not really just out of the sound check. We grabbed some Subway before filming this. Um, but yeah, we had I had the sound check and it was really, really fun. Um, there's a little surprise maybe that might be happening on stage, so just stay tuned for that. Yes. But that was really fun. Good. Um, met some lovely people at the sound check and it went really really well so I'm really excited for tomorrow the venue is insane it's really it's cool so it is cool. really cool so yeah, yeah. especially the room you're like actually singing in yeah, like yeah, that yeah. is like it's so fun awesome. it's so cool um, it's a really cool vibe on the stage yeah, so it's good yeah it's exciting. just excited so tonight we're just gonna go to the cinema um, and see the boy too because that's just out and it's a horror film and we love horror films yeah. so we're gonna treat ourselves to that um, so yeah we also, might not just gonna say something if you watch mine you're gonna see people walking past and waving so yeah we just that. found cars and it was insanely awkward and like <laughs> then i had to come on and do this one the and... amount of people that were walking past us at the time and like, kept looking and then there was one guy who was just like yeah <coughs> it was it was gold it was gold but yeah, yeah so look out for that as well just wanted to self-plug and just let you know it's fucking yeah hard. subscribe to say your channel name I don't know my channel name. Flan Emma Flanagan. <laughs> I was about to say Flanagan. Emma Flanagan. Just check the descriptions. Think, yeah, it's down in the description. Um, yeah. <laughs> so I probably won't vlog that much tonight just because no. we're just going to go to the cinema and have some chill. But if anything fun happens, I'll update you on that. And if not, then we'll see you tomorrow. Yep. Bye. See you later. See you later. Bye. So we're walking outside of uh, VidCon. We're just heading home, heading to the cinema. And guess who just came on? Emma's favourite! I'd, Cher! That was, that was Cher, yeah, it was Gypsy Strands and these. Love her. So, yeah. No. Just wanted to get a record of that. Okay. Because Emma didn't hate it. I wasn't listening to it. She didn't hate it. Because I wasn't it. listening. She didn't hate it. I just started going, come on, you boys, and green, but cut that bit out. VidCon, it is the like second day for us, but really the first day yesterday was just sound check. So today's the day that I'm going to be performing, which is really exciting. Yeah. And um, we're hoping we're going to bump into Eleanor Neal. Hopefully, fingers crossed. She's um, still here. She's still out and about, and she's still here. So we're going to head and do that just now. Hey, so we're just in the expo hall at the moment. We just met Eleanor Neal, and she was like the like, nicest the person, person ever. She was so sweet. Yeah. Um, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> So, so, 
so crazy excited. It is insane. VidCon 2020, here we go. You today, and we've got some fun games to play with your favorite performances and musicians. So yeah, are you guys really excited? We're excited, we're excited. We're excited. We're excited. We're excited. Come on, let's go. That's a dad joke off. Okay, so here are the rules. You each get one joke each, and you guys are going to vote who's the winner. So I'm going to go to this side. There's going to be a big screen on this side, depending on who wins. So who wants to go? The yes! 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 Who is the amazing to design the microphone? That's the right answer. It's the cowboy over the moon. Yes. The most noise possible for VidCon. Guys. One, two, three! <laughs> what was the title of Lee's most oh. popular video on the first year of YouTube? On oh, that evening, I don't know that. Uh, I don't know any titles. <laughs> Can I help him? No. Oh. What was it? I love it when you call me, senorita. I wish I could pretend I didn't need you, but every touch is ooh la la la. It's true, la la la. Here we go, let's go! Oh no, we're going, now we're ready. I love you and I wish I never did. I swear to God, I swear to God, you stupid bitch. <laughs> So that's us just back home from VidCon. It's like the second but kind of first day for us. Just off performing, it was such an incredible experience. It was insane. Everyone was so nice and it was so much fun. It was so good. So um, I'll insert a couple of clips in here, maybe, or maybe just before this, um, but I'll put up the full video on my channel or I will have done already by the time you're seeing this, but I'll make sure to link it down below anyway to make sure that you don't miss that if you want to check it out. We met some lovely people as well, both backstage. Taz was so nice. We chatted to her for ages yeah. Um, met a couple of other creators. Everyone was so, so nice. And then Amazing afterwards, though. yeah, he Emma managed great. to meet him. Um, her little sister Erin is a massive fan, so he did a little video for her, which was lovely. And then Keen and Jesse, yeah, <laughs> Keen and fucking Molly. Wow. Yeah, exactly. So it was a very, it was a very good night. It was so much fun. So so grateful to VidCon and to Ryan for giving me the opportunity. Um, and, and for giving yeah. me the opportunity. Yeah, and for giving the opportunity for. I'm not going to show you her because she's like it's literally fine. naked, but. <laughs> Oh, okay, so thank you, you so much experience <laughs> of a lifetime. Um, probably won't be able to do it again because we're skint as fuck. Look at that eyelash. She tried. I tried. Wait. Oh. So I just want to say a massive thank you to VidCon London and to Ryan for giving me the opportunity to perform. It was incredible, so much fun. And we actually met some lovely people afterwards as well who came up and said hello. Don't mind Emma, we're both very tired. Um, it's been a very long day, but it's been amazing. Um, and yeah, we met some lovely people afterwards who came up and spoke and it was just so much fun. It was genuinely the best day ever. Um, and tomorrow it's gonna be so much fun as well because we're gonna go and see a couple of different talks by creators. So I'm really excited to see Tana and then we're gonna be going to see BuzzFeed Unsolved as well. Mm -hmm. We're massive fans of Shane and Ryan. So it's so exciting. And so we're also going to see my favorite YouTubers, but we can't disclose who they are because yeah. We can't.
because for health and safety reasons. They're actually dying. Look at how depressed I was. I know, both the, of us were like, it was great. Right. It was like, so but fun. it was, it was so amazing. But we're just like, we've been out all day. We had a pretty full on start to the day as well because like traveling and then we ended up meeting Eleanor, which I mentioned earlier. She was so nice. Um, But yeah, it was very, very busy and pretty hectic today. Um, But in the best possible way. So we're now going to go and get our beauty sleep and then wake up at friggin' best six o'clock. I'm so going to sleep tonight. I'm so tired. And then we're going to be waking up at like 6 a.m. or something ridiculous. And then I've got to get the, bo the bus. The bus? Yeah, I've got to get the bus home. The overnight bus. Yeah, I'm so fucking. Kill me. I don't know if I can swear, but kill me. R.I.P. Kill me, because I don't want to. Kill me. <laughs> kill me. <laughs> so fun so far we went we managed to make it to there was one at like half nine this morning emma cut me off when i was about to say she was the one that made us late but anyway we'll move on okay. from that um yeah but we we got here pretty much on time we we made it for it which was yeah. the positive um and then we went to see tana and friends which was amazing we got to see the first ever premiere it was like the premiere i think of um her series and uh, no filter season two so that was great um and it was really nice seeing them all on stage they seemed like lovely people and we're now waiting about to go and see buzzfeed and so which we're so excited but that's at like two so yes right we're wasting time <laughs> oh it's actually one dairy yeah we could and what was it two or half two yeah we could go get see what was it though two or half two i think it was two um but yeah so we've got Ooh, that and then we're gonna go and see one later where unjaded jade's doing like a mental health talk with like holy yeah. brock and stuff <laughs> um, <laughs> so we're gonna go see them and it should be fun <laughs> um and then there's like the big music thing at night so yeah it's a good day um we haven't vlogged yet until now okay, so, so, so yeah right there there's one so it was a thing that people in the community got together so Lovely to have you here. Here she is, in London, at Hi, London, how are you? <laughs> so yesterday at my meet and greet, I was yelling, and this lovely girl looked at me, and she was like, why are you shouting? <laughs> and I was like, okay, so London's really calm. <laughs> so I'm trying to keep it calm for you guys this morning. <laughs> we can be chill, zen, that's fine. We can do that, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I feel like I could just talk in the rest of the panel on a British accent, no? That was quite good. <laughs> You're in London, bruv. Okay, well, should we do it? Should we challenge ourselves? I'm should I offend to all of you for the next 20 minutes, yeah. like? Yeah. All right. I don't oh. have it. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm thought. Gonna... I'm gonna do it. It made you laugh, and you know, you guys are very chill, so I feel like when I make you laugh, I have to keep going. Yeah, it's good, I like it. All right. Uh, Lewis Forster says, what inspired you to become a singer? And there's a like, little tease to music stuff happening in there. <laughs> what, what more is uh, um, coming on the music front? So many people listening to Hefner. <laughs> like, I was like, why is there so many people listening to this song? So then I was like, maybe I should make some more music. And then I met someone like Modson, who really understood how to help me make something maybe a little better. So, um, It's yeah. good, the accent's good. Thank you. I like the, uh, the ambient walk-up that had no fanfare to it all. It's very much our style. It's a surprise. And, hello. 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 Um, it was like, Stephen, we're going to put you in this set. We were actually, the guy who was working there was the guy who was there when we shot the episode. Yeah. Was Ian. He's a lovely man. Great. It's um, a good gin cocktail. Yeah. But Ian was like, I could take you down to the cell. And Ryan was like, we're going to put Stephen in that cell. He's going to lose his mind. But Stephen's fine. It's not scary. <laughs> <laughs> it's not scary. Like Stephen didn't do any reach out. Though. Whatever. He was still in the Stephen was like, oh, I don't like that Ouija board there. I'm not going to do anything. I don't like messing with that stuff. I'm just going to sit here. Why would you invite danger into your life? There it is. Danger. You believe. <laughs> <laughs> if there's nothing there, then why is it dangerous? I do believe in the spiritual realm. Boom. 
There was nothing in that basement. No. There wasn't. And I can, you know, the way that I, I know you're like very genuine in trying to find a ghost, and I know that you think you found one, but I really, <laughs> I think that that's not like on in a, on a camera setting. I, I, we got a ghost walking by on camera. <laughs> He's in Vanel. Who are you talking about? Yeah, that's right. Oh, cool. <laughs> Um. Hey, so we're just out of the what was it called? Like the mental health. The mental trap? health. Yeah. So I know. I don't know. What um. Called, yeah. yeah, we went there. And Jada Jade was supposed to be there, but she wasn't, unfortunately. But hopefully she's all right because they did really nice. No, they never said it. So it was still really, really good. Um, it was like Sam, Colby, and then Holly H. A TikToker, yeah, and, and then another girl. I, the other girl, I can't, I can't, I can't remember, remember her name. name. I feel really bad about but that. But she was lovely. They were all so, so, so nice. Yeah, they um, all had like amazing information and stuff. And they said at the start as well, they gave like a disclaimer that. Um, none of their like advice was like professional, so if you are actually yeah, then to go and yeah, which that. I thought was a good thing as well because Definitely. like yeah, that I know it's, it's like, good to have your YouTubers like your influencers telling you what to do, but also like professionals are professional. Yeah, so like exactly. it's good that they did that as well. Exactly, they could have just said yeah. nothing and and it's such a off that. it's a topic that people don't overly talk about too no. much, and it's only been recently that it's kind of yeah, it's like a taboo know, subject. Yeah, so it's yeah. great that at a convention like this, they're really kind of shedding light on that when it's oh, something amazing. that affects everyone. Yeah. You know, yeah. so yeah, that was really really good um, and now that's basically us done there's a there's the night of music that's on later on and it's like Samantha Harvey and Harvey and a couple of other artists that are performing so we're gonna go check that out and yeah. see what it's like um, so yeah we'll get back to you later I'll probably insert a couple of little bits from that and um, we do go long and yeah. yeah we'll catch you later Bye. You can tell me what you
Hello. So um, we're kind of. <laughs> I told you. I can't help. I immediately regret this decision. Um. So. It's <laughs> very Okay, you have four minutes. Wrap this up. <laughs> okay. Oh, so no, you have seven minutes. Wait, yeah. what? Have we missed one? No, four minutes. No, because that says... Oh, yeah, no. Okay, seven minutes. We I haven't missed it, but it. they just... Yeah. So, <laughs> we are currently at the tube station, um, and Emma is about to head home, because we just got back from VidCon just a couple of hours ago, really, and then we went for dinner and then headed back, grabbed her stuff and then headed off. Oh, but I also took took okay. off my makeup and um you know <laughs> went for short well <laughs> took off my makeup, got into my jammies kind of my jammy top and yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So um <laughs> Okay. We've had crazy stalker so, creepy weird. I genuinely people. I think next week we should do a story time on it. So we yeah. had like a very interesting travel experience this whole weekend. It was very funny. So I'm going to London next week again. So. Yeah, no. Um, more vlogs. Kind of, yeah, more vlogs. Um so yeah, I wanted to make this just because after we finished like vlogging, I think, like we ended up. We just about, finished. We no, we literally we, like, just put the thing down. I wonder if that's why you asked us. Maybe. I think we just finished. Or I but anyway, we just finished and then we bumped into this guy and he just kind of came up and started talking to us and he was like clearly he had a camera so, uh, a very fancy camera so he was like obviously a youtuber like we yeah, could tell and, and it was like on. um and so he was like oh would you girls like like to be a part of a video and he was like and we were like, so, like i was like yeah <laughs> yeah because she has no stranger danger <laughs> um but yeah he was like oh would you want to be part of the video and we were like oh and i was like yes okay um <laughs> and he was like oh like what who's the smartest between you um and emma said me so that's going down in history well i agree here first. that i believe like, definitely after after what happened yeah, I, believe it. I think that this Beth is the smartest but not like all the time like I'm smarter in like situations I would say in like, what sense? like not laughing that's like your only strong point you're bringing to the table that you can hold I'm, in a laugh I'm, I'm a, a smarter actress questions about Sweden because he was from Sweden Sweden. Um, so he asked me like five questions and I got them all right so for like the prize for it, um, he said that like I was the only one to get them all right, which I, we kind of both thought was a bit sketchy because it's been like a whole weekend. But that wasn't the bit I found sketchy, I just found <laughs> him in general sketchy, but he it seemed nice. Yeah, well like the video did. Fuck. <laughs> We're digging a hole. Just <laughs> carry on. <laughs> Basically he'll be like down below, enjoy the video. <laughs> so, um, so he gave me a prize. He gave me a prize of a Sweden hat. And I'll, I'll model it for you, so you can see. <laughs> I thought he was going to ask me to put it on in the He video. said it's really warm. <laughs> and he's telling the truth. <laughs> he ain't a liar. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Imagine that guy had seen me. <laughs> the guy that fucking did a double take. <laughs> you look like a smile. Oh my god, I've got hat here now, look. <laughs> Oh, man. So he gave her that, um, you and got, like, I got one. Bag. I got. I can't show you because it's in my like, bag somewhere. But I got like a fridge magnet that said Sweden. <laughs> it was like for your camera techniques or whatever. Like it wasn't. He literally was like favoring Beth, and then we spoke about. <laughs> and then you said that you were prettier than me at the end. Yeah. And then he was like, I can't comment on that. Yeah, because because that would be creepy. It would be creepy. But then he kind of hinted as well, and it was like that just made it creepier. <laughs> Yeah, I think you should have just left it. Yeah, I think you should have be been like, like haha, ha. instead of being like, mm. I can't comment. Yeah. That so, yeah. he didn't like his lips. <laughs> I can't comment. <laughs> so after that, we then went back into the music night yeah. and um, we call Samantha Harvey, but like the last song of hers. Yeah, some R&B guy. Yeah. And, and then, then we saw Harvey. Yeah, Harvey, who was great. <laughs> <laughs> Harvey. We really enjoyed Harvey. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say that? What if I meet him one day? And How I'm old like, is he? I think he's like 22. Maybe okay, then, we should yeah. not. So he's hot. I Wait. was like more thinking if he was like underage. 
Like that would be really awkward. I didn't think about that. He got he has a tattoo. He looks he a bit has young. A neck tattoo. Yeah, but I'm getting a tattoo next week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So um, we saw him and he was great. He like sung his what the song that's like personal. So I knew that before going, um, <coughs> but Emma knew it from a TikTok. So yeah, that was fun. So she ended up knowing one of his songs before we went. Yeah. So I didn't know um, it was him though. So I was like, oh. Yeah. And only in the course. It so it was really fun, and then we bumped into one of the um, guys who I, I chatted to yesterday, who like helped organise VidCon, and mm -hmm. he came and gave me some really nice feedback that they got after my performance yesterday. It was really nice. He just said that they've been getting a lot of really positive feedback, and just that they really enjoyed the performance. So it was a really nice like end to the weekend. It was like a proper highlight. Yeah. Um, and then we travelled home in the tube, and there's a story to tell with that. But I think this vlog is going to be so long. <laughs> Yeah, the vlog's gonna be so long. Why the fuck does it say Edward Gurgel Square again? <laughs> look, <laughs> look, it's another two minutes. Now we have to wait another six minutes for this. Let's just show. get on the next one. Oh, f this is travel. This is this is this can also this go on next week. This is travel anxiety. Freaking vlog. I told you, Jesus this Christ. <laughs> this is eternal sex. Jesus Christ. My thing's at eleven. I thought it was at half eleven. No, it's at eleven. <laughs> Emma stays in London for a week. Fuck off, go to that. You didn't tell me that. You told me I guess I said 11. 100%. I told you 11. Oh, it's not going to be that long. We're getting the next one no matter what. <laughs> so yeah. Um, yeah, I'll probably film before Emma like heads off anyway. Like we'll probably do a little bit like on the tube or something maybe. Because likely anything's going to go wrong. But. If not, thank you so much for watching and I'll probably do some sort of like ender when I get back anyway. But ender. thanks so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much to Ben <coughs> for an incredible weekend. We had an absolute blast. Performing was a dream and everyone was so so nice. And yeah, we had an amazing day today. So yeah, wish us luck for the tube. Hopefully everything doesn't go wrong. You made it though. I don't think yeah, that. Yeah, we did really? I thought you were gonna not miss not make it, but Funny. Yay! We'll be down next week, so yeah. we'll be better time as next week. I'll see you next week. Yeah. Hey, so I have just dropped off Emma at Victoria. She was getting the bus back home. So I think we just ended that thinking that she would miss the bus and we were so close. I thought that the bus was at half 11, but apparently it was 11. <laughs> um, and uh, when she asked me when would be a good time to leave, she didn't say that it was 11. So I thought it was half 11. Um, so luckily we left when we did because she literally just made the bus. But knowing her, something else is definitely going to go wrong in the journey. So hopefully she's fine and hopefully it's all okay. But stay tuned for next week when she's back down and we'll definitely do try and fit in a story time of the transport story because as i've said in my previous video so i guess a little bit of a shameless plug here if you haven't already checked it out then um it's travel story gone wrong um, so definitely check that out i'll link it down below or if i can work out how to put it on the screen it'll be here too but definitely check that out down below but yeah as you know from that travel and me are not close friends and apparently it's the same for Emma because this weekend was an absolute riot I don't think I've ever had so many moments on the tube and on trains and things it was a nightmare um but very funny so we'll definitely share that with you but yeah I'm kind of at the moment after dropping her off it's really sad I really miss her already it's only been like five minutes or something um, but yeah a bit of the kind of post blues after such an amazing weekend but honestly it was just so incredible and like I said earlier I'd just like to say a massive thank you to VidCon for the opportunity that I am a performer. Competition is such an incredible thing um, same with the I am a creator one as well just to give up and coming creators the chance to experience something like that is just incredible um, and to be the I am a performer winner 2020 is beyond a dream come true it was honestly so incredible. Yesterday the performance so much fun everyone was so lovely we spoke to Taz especially um for ages she was so nice everyone was so lovely um and then today we got to go and see some of our favorite creators give a talk so highlights for today for me were definitely BuzzFeed Unsolved that was incredible I love him so much Shane and Ryan are hilarious um yeah and they talked about the Viaduct Tavern which was really cool because I ended up visiting there one of the first times I came to London because of them so the fact that they were talking about how they'd revisited and just all the upcoming stuff that they've got going on was really nice and fun and seeing Tana was amazing too um, and yeah it ended it ended great and we really enjoyed the um, the mental health talk as well so it was a really good day and it ended in such a high with Harvey as well 
um, and then getting some lovely feedback as well from the people who <laughs> put together Redcon, I suppose. Um, so yeah, massive thank you to them again for that opportunity. So that's me finally home. I'm about to go for a shower, go to bed. I have class at half nine tomorrow morning. So um, it's already, I think about, I think it's about half 12-ish. Um, so I'm gonna try and go for a really quick shower and then head to bed so that I don't miss tomorrow. But yeah, thank you so much for the best weekend. It was so much fun. I feel like I'm getting a little bit of post blues just now, especially after just dropping off Emma and after having an amazing time. But it was truly just such a weekend. And yeah, I just, I can't thank everyone enough for just being so kind. I mean, <laughs> obviously no one knew who I was um, when I was there. And to get that reception when I went on stage amongst so many really well-known, lovely, talented, fantastic creators, it was, it was such an amazing night. It was really a dream come true. And this weekend has been so fun. So Emma's coming down next weekend. Um, because we're going to be going to see a show in London. So we will be vlogging that and um, yeah, I'm sure there'll be lots of laughs. So do be sure to tune in. Make sure you go and subscribe to her channel if you haven't already. I'll leave that down below as well. And make sure you check out our video when I was back up in Scotland over the Christmas holidays. We did a ghost bus tour vlog thing and then we went to um, the Christmas market. So if you enjoyed this one, I'm sure you'll enjoy that one too. So make sure you check that out down below as well. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you were at VidCon and you came over and said hello, thank you so much you have made my weekend i am so overjoyed um and yeah i also had some really exciting news so my single my new upcoming single beautiful illusion is now up for pre-sale surprise <laughs> i've been saying for about pretty much almost three years now that there's new music coming soon um and i've just been working really hard behind the scenes just making sure that everything was kind of ready for it um, and that the songs were how I wanted them to be um, and that it was the right time to release them. So I have a lot of upcoming music this year. Surprise. Um, but yeah, the first one is Beautiful Illusion. It's a single. The artwork and everything is now online because the song is up for pre-save. I will leave the link to that below. You can pre-save it on Spotify, I think Google Play, Amazon Music and possibly Apple Music as well. But check that out down below and it will be available to stream, download, save, whatever, add to your playlist on the 6th of March 2020. So I really hope you enjoy that and yeah, thank you so much for being on this journey with me. It means so much more than you will ever know. I really hope you've enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in the next one. Be sure to press the subscribe button down below. Press the little notification bell as well just to make sure that you never miss whenever I post a video. Make sure that you share this video as well. Leave comments, give it a like if you enjoyed it just to get the word out about my music and my videos and my channel. And thank you so much again for your support. It means the world. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> what are you doing, Emma? Nothing. She's eating hand time. <laughs> she smells like garlic. You don't smell like garlic. <laughs> really? <laughs> Fucking shower, you stinky bitch. Danny DeVito. It must be love. My hair looks fine, so. Does this work as an angle? Not really, no. That has like finished for the day, so we'll definitely update you. <laughs> we'll definitely update you later on when we go tomorrow because we're going to see Tana and I'm feeling excited and BuzzFeed on Salt and some other great creators, I'm sure. Um, so yeah, we will definitely speak later. Uh, we love you. Bye. <laughs> mute that bit. Just mute that one wee bit, right? And let people think I like, did oh, something really bad. Oh my yeah. gosh, I can't believe you said that. I just like sang. <laughs> this one's not fucking coming off. <laughs> Why is it such a satisfying experience? Oh. <laughs>
Whoa, look at the amount of fucking glue in that one compared to this one. I know, that's why that one stuck down and the other one didn't. Oh, that's a nice mark in the middle. Yes. Shin accommodation. The highlights. I know I didn't say it right, but like, I meant road. <laughs> no, it was that look you were like, what you tell someone. <gasps> no, like, not in a good way. Tunnel. So we just want to say a massive, massive oh, thank you. Fuck. Oh, it's true. <laughs> Did you not see that look? So get back to that angle. I genuinely like. I can't. Nice. Wow. Beauty girl. Still didn't speak was... a word to me. <laughs> so yeah. So we just want to say a massive, massive thank you. My nose looks weird with the light. Oh my gosh, I feel like I need sleep. Hello, Emma. Right, never so, film in a tube station. I know, this Just the in worst case you thought you were gonna <laughs> ever want to do that. You know. But Beth is gonna pretend she's a fan, so then I'm gonna be like, Beth, chill out, it's okay. They're normal people, and then they'll be like, oh my god, Emma, you're the girl of my dreams. And I'll be like, oh my god, stop, person. I'm not gonna say her name. I'll be like, stop. And then they'll be like, I, I, I think I love you and I'll be like, mm, I like you, you're okay. And then I'll be like, Emma, marry me. And I'll be like, mm, okay, since you asked. And then we'll get married and then we'll go live where they live. And then we will party every day. It'll be great. And we're going to get married and yeah, Beth can be my maid of honour and my auntie of my kids, not my auntie. Of your dog kids. Mm -mm. Okay. Well, well that's going to be fun. I can't wait for that tomorrow. But I'm really excited for Tana. Yeah, I can't and wait for my wedding tomorrow. Yeah. The police. <laughs> I'm Shell. <laughs> Don't tell her. I've been smarter than you sometimes. You've said stupid things. <laughs> you say, you know, we both say What was it? Sev several? She thought it was seven. I still think that the word several right. should be seven. That's I'm not going to matter. Okay, anyway. Point of story. Um, he, so Emma was going to film it. What's the capital of Sweden? So I got that, it was Stockholm. Emma said that she wouldn't have got that, so no. that was a nice moment for me because my geography is shocking. I got a D um, in geography. I didn't sit geography, so. Um, <laughs> you didn't pack how it. did you not? Yeah, I well, packed it. Okay. Because I thought I was gonna. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> this piece there. Did he look at me? Yes. I think he looked. Yeah, he did. Ooh. Not at me though, probably at you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a don't potato. Even. <laughs> <laughs> Look over, look over, look over, look over. He's gonna look before he leaves a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. A bit, a bit. He does. <laughs> <laughs> I can't read guys' names. That's fucking mental. Oh my god. Imagine that guy had seen me. The guy that fucking. Da da double two. Um, music night? Yes. I'm just like trying to remember what we did. Did it? Did it? So. <laughs> so Thanks guys, we'll see you in the next one. Guten Tag. Cause you